our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. All right, now with the official introductions, we go inside the octagon of Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Magnifico! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, King! You ready to fight? You ready? All right, ready to go for round one. As many of you know, this young man won his last fight by knockout. No TKO, flush knockout for him the last time out. And now he is getting a shot against a truly elite fighter in this division. The question is, when the challenges get stiffer, will his game raise up to that next level? Throughout his career, when the challenges have gotten tougher, he has raised his game. That is exactly the goal in front of him tonight. Well, you gotta move your head. You've gotta be preemptive. You cannot wait until your opponent starts to throw something in your direction. Well, why fix what's not broken? Why not go right back to that overhand here again? Outstanding knee to the body there. He's the taller fighter. Might as well put that size to good use, and he certainly did so there. All right, so as advertised thus far, as these fighters continue to trade strikes. That looks as though that strike maybe opened up a cut around the eye area. Yeah, it looks like that strike opened up a cut, John, but it's nothing to worry about now, but he's got to start to protect it. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Nice straight right hand. Just out of range with that right hand. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter. Hey, it was perfect. It was absolutely perfect, John. Great placement on that uppercut. All right, half guard position for him here, and I can hear Dominic Cruz in the back of my head just screaming about underhooks somewhere. Yeah, somewhere. he loved. I mean, but he's right, right? He's so right in terms of. of setting up a submission. Oh, that guillotine choke is tight. Oh, somehow, some way he got out. These guys are back and forth, but the submission defense wins this transition. Wow, he actually reversed the position, but he didn't stop there. He took a strong top position himself. 45 seconds to go here in round one. Oh, he's back up again. You got to like that. Oh, he gets the takedown late in the round. Very useful here towards the tail end of the frame. Strong knee strike there. Another nice knee there. Oh, he's got his back. He's got to isolate a hip to try to break that lock. Breaking the lock is step number one to escape. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. All right, so now this damage really bears watching, right? His face compromised, and you got to think it's going to start affecting his output as well offensively. Well, you got to look from the start to make mistakes, trying to overcompensate for all the shots that he's taken to the face, for all the swelling. I have seen on many occasions where someone has massive swelling, 
and they struggle. Look for this guy to start to mess up a little bit in there. You ready to fight? You ready? Let's do All it. right, round two. Lands a nice straight. Nice combination lands to the head. was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. We send it inside now to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 23 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by Knockout King. So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by Knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am going to knock this man out. He did it in an even more impressive fashion than he ever could have imagined.